Verinag is a town named after and famous for the Verinag Spring and Mughal Garden, near Anantnag city in Anantnag district of the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir, India. It is a notified area committee with Tehsil status Shahbad Bala Verinag, and is about 26 km away from Anantnag and approximately 78 km southeast from Srinagar which is the summer capital of the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir. Verinag is also the first tourist spot of Kashmir Valley when travelling by road from Jammu, the winter capital of the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir towards Srinagar. There is an octagonal stone basin at Verinag Spring and an arcade surrounding it which were built by Mughal Emperor Jahangir in 1620 AD later, a beautiful garden next to the spring, was laid out by his son Shah Jahan. This spring is known to never dry up or overflow. Verinag Spring is also the major source of River Jhelum. Verinag Spring and Mughal Arcade surrounding it is officially recognized by Archaeological Survey of India as a monument of national importance. Verinag Spring is the main source of River Jhelum, which flows throughout the valley of Kashmir and finally enters into Pakistan. Verinag Spring which is in Verinag town, issues from a high scarp of a mountain spur, and is considered the source of the Jhelum River. It is situated at the bottom of a hill covered by pine trees and evergreen plants. Verinag Spring was originally an irregular and shapeless pond, and water, oozing out from different places in it and spread about and formed a little mass. Emperor Jahangir, whose artistic taste for polishing the beauty of nature is well known, saw this and at once determined to improve it. He built the octagonal tank of sculptured stones round it, so that all water was collected therein, for which carvers were brought from Iran. A garden was also built by Jahangir next to this natural spring which is of pre-Islamic religious significance. The construction date of the octagonal tank and the garden is 1029 Hijri or 1620 AD, during the 15th year of the Jahangir's reign, which is duly inscribed on a stone slab built into the southern wall of the spring. Seven years later, Jahangir's son Shah Jahan, who was no less a lover of natural beauty, constructed cascades and aqueducts in straight lines through and around the fine garden which he, in order to enhance further the beauty of the place laid out in front of the spring. He also built hot and cold baths to the east of this garden, just outside it, of which little trace is now left. The water contained in an octagonal spring has crystal blue water in which a variety of big fishes live. History and the carvings on stones in Persian on the walls surrounding the spring tell about how this great source of underwater spring is contained without revealing its architecture. The water is collected in a pool surrounded by ash tree cesses, and then flows down a 300-yard canal to the Behat River. Jahangir wished to be buried at Verinag Gardens, but his wife, Noor Jahan, disobeyed his wishes. Today nothing remains of the pavilions which once decorated the area.